Hello everyone, it is Sunday. Welcome to the first episode of my Final Fantasy V Forge Up Fiesta run. This is Harmony Muse. And I've got a, before we get started, this is a special dedication. I dedicate this run to my mother who watched me play video games probably since I was three years old. And also to a good friend who passed away less than a week ago, the Twitch streamer Rat Clown Tar. We are specifically playing the Pixel Remaster version on Steam. Father, do you really have to go? You know I do, dear. I need you to protect the castle. Under no circumstances are you to follow me, do you understand? But father... Something is wrong with the wind. I must go to the wind shrine to make certain nothing has happened to the crystal. Uh, yes, I've noticed it as well, but to go alone is... Lena, don't worry. I'll be fine. Have faith. Not, 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 not. There's a lot of that in this game. Roar. We're the pirates who don't do anything. And that's copyrighted too. The wind just stopped. I've got to hurry. The wind stopped! Father! What in blazes? bit more advanced than old school mode 7. And our intro. Why yes, that looks like an Xbox controller settings because that's what I'm using. Meteorite. Boko, wait here, okay?
Hey, are you all right? Y yes, I believe so. I give you my thanks. My name is Lana, and you are? Me? Now, the official translation is Bart's. Which is probably a more accurate translation of bots. But the original RPGE translation, or fan translation, named him But What we're going to name him is But But <laughs> this rock suddenly fell from the sky. The impact must have knocked me out. Guess it's a meteorite. A meteorite? I wonder if it has a connection to the wind stopping. Again, I give you my thanks. I wish I could do something more to show my appreciation, but I really must go. Whoa, hey, hold up a sec. Butts, did you hear something? Huh? Oh. Uh, help me. <sighs> Over there. You know, I really like the minimap edition they added to the Pixel Remaster. It's in every single one of the six. Are you all right? Oh, where am I? Oh, my aching head. Sakes alive, what happened? I don't remember. Uh -huh. I can't remember anything. Looks like you hit your head pretty bad. Maybe you got amnesia. Oh, something came back to me. My name's Galuf. That's a start. Anything else? Nope, just the name. Other than that, my memory's completely blank. <laughs> I'm very sorry, but you must excuse me. I have no time to waste. Where are you going? We must go to the Wind Shrine. The Wind Shrine, now that you mention it, I'm pretty sure that's where I was headed. And I'm decided I'm going with you, but... I gotta get to that shrine. I feel it in my bones. You've got to take me with. But what about you? Sorry, I'm going to bow out of this one. Good luck. But thank you again. Farewell. Godspeed and all that whatnot. So, with a four-job fiesta run, what that is, is with Final Fantasy V, you normally get a selection of jobs at every crystal you unlock. With the four-job fiesta, you get a choice of one job from each crystal. One and only one, randomly chosen for you by the event creator. I also picked Berserker Risk, which means any one of those jobs can be replaced by Berserker. Ow, Boko! Bad! Bad, Chocobo! What are you doing stopping like that? Now, don't you give me that look. Wah, wah, wah. Yeah, I know. The girl and the old man went off together, but with all the goblins around these parts... Fine, I got it, I got it. Now, the trick is, you're supposed to apply, you know, knowledge of the game and your familiarity with the skills of the jobs that you're assigned to show that you can beat the game with that limited skill set. 
It's a challenge run. Ah! Yeah. Boko, come on! Ah. Now, some jobs are considered lucky. Some jobs, very unlucky. And I could be lucky and get one of the mages or knight for my wind crystal job. I could be very unlucky and get monk or thief. We'll see. Oh. Now, Thief has utility, but for a combat job, it completely both blows and sucks. Good morning. But! Seems like I can't escape being in your debt. Hey, don't worry about it. Seems like the rebels meteor... Seems like the meteorite's impact caused a few landslides. The road's covered in rubble. I don't think you're going to be able to make it to Tool this way. But if I can't get to the Wind Shrine, then... Uh, wind Shrine, gotta hurry. The old guy's pretty dead set on getting there, too. Alright, I'll go with you and personally see to it that you get there safely. Oh, really? Yeah, I, you know, my dad always wanted me to go out and travel the world. Plus, it also feels like the wind's calling me. What a sweet talker. As if you don't just have the hots for the little lady. What, you're awake? Don't sound so surprised. This old dog's always ready for anything. Still, the road's blocked, huh? I won't give up. There must be a way to reach, or reach the wind shrine. Right, and we'll find it. All right, let's ride. I don't remember there being a cave here. Probably opened up during one of those quakes. Boko, I think this is going to be a little dangerous for Co Chocobos. You stay here, okay? Now, let's see what kind of equipment we've got on the rest of the party. Okay. Butts has a broadsword and leather armor. Lena has a knife and leather armor. Galuf is just punching things. What's that spring? Intro, okay. Actually. Can't even hurt him. Ew. Old man, you've been huffing paint? You're not hurt, hitting them very hard at all. Or is that just a sad thing about bare hand in this game? Good lord. We need to get you some levels. And a decent weapon.
But we have verified bare hand can crit. Oh, pirates. You know, it should be mentioned that over the last 10 years, I have done the four job fiesta run multiple, multiple times. So a lot of what I'm saying is snark. Aha, so that's how you get in. Now you'll notice a weight statistic in their in inventory screen. The higher a character's weight is, the slow, slightly slower they will act. Now given identical agility, the higher weight character will act marginally slower. Now we'll go forward. Now I'm not trying any sort of speed run or any sort of fancy run. Not going for style points, not going for any sort of fancy. You know, you'll also notice the amount of damage you deal is slightly a function of your level. That he was doing 30 damage, Leno, or Butts was, to these enemies. Now he's doing 32. Or, well, 30, 32, well, yeah. He's doing slightly more. Look at that. That ship was how... How was it sailing with the wind so weak? Wait till you see how. <laughs> a pirate hideout, meaning the ship was almost have been a pirate ship. I wonder if they might give us a ride. Um, I think the only ride they'd be interested in get would be a keel haul for all three of us. Yeah, you can't ask for a favor from a pirate. That's why we'll just sneak on and steal their ship. Huh, you're pretty gutsy for an old-timer. <laughs> yeah, he's got a case of brass ones.
snore. Uh, <laughs> Yo ho ho and stuff. Time to cast off. Well, cast off means start sailing, kid. I know that. The wheel won't even budge. How do you work this thing? It's I work in anything and they'll leave the devil to pay. I don't know why, but I always give Ferris here more less of a pirate accent and more of an Irish accent. Trying to steal my ship out of yet. You have a lot of brass. Or mayhap you're lacking in brains. I wag I wager it's a latter. Wait, I'm Princess Lena of Tycoon! Please accept my apologies for trying to for attempting to commander your ship or commandeer your ship. Wait, she's a princess? So the girl's royalty. Sir, this is a formal request from the Kingdom of Tycoon. Please allow us the use of your vessel. I must get to the Wind Shrine. My father's in danger. Ha 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 ha! Oh, the Princess Tycoon? Get on my ship. I'm sure we can fetch a tasty sum for this one. Hey, leave her alone, you degenerate, luxurious, piratey pirate! I beg of you, please! That pendant. Toss a lot of them into the brig. Aye, aye, Captain! Well, this is a fine how do you do. What genius came up with the idea to steal a pirate ship anyway? Look in the mirror, Pops. Oh, my aching head. I can't remember a thing. And your amnesia oh so conveniently returns. Still, I can't believe you're really the princess of Tycoon, Lena. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to keep it a secret or intend. Why do I keep tripping over words like that? Anyway. It's not that big of a deal, but if you're the princess, why were you going to the wind shrine all alone? My father's there. He hadn't been gone long when the wind dropped almost nothing. I just can't shake the feeling that something terrible is happening. I slipped out of the castle and headed for the shrine, but then that meteorite fell, and you know the rest. Why does the Princess of Tycoon have the same pendant as I do? Foreshadowing much? I mean, anybody who's done a Final Fantasy four or five four job fiesta run already knows this. But yeah, this is intended as foreshadowing. She said her father's at the Wind Shrine. Prepare to, uh, prepare to cast off, lads. Set a course to the wind shrine. But, Captain, what about the land lovers? Untie them. Sometime today would be nice. But why? I reconsider your request. You can go back to the brig if you'd prefer. Pull anchor, we sail for the wind shrine. Hey, something wrong with your ears today. I hope I don't have to repeat myself. Well, I, aye, 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 Captain.
you notice they did not put out any sales. But the wind has stopped. How can the ship move? Full of curiosity, aren't you, lass? Sildra, come up and say hello. Beautiful, isn't she? Sildur and I were raised together, one of his closest siblings. In the original Japanese, it was like beautiful, or beautiful isn't he, we're his closest brothers. Or at least that's how it was translated in the RPGE version. This version, while they've taken a lot of liberties, is a lot more flavor. Japanese is one of those languages where a literal translation is often not the best. And can often come out very, very flat because of the nuances in the language. All right, we're off. Captain, shall I sail over to the wind shrine for you? No, I know the way. It's literally straight up. Princess Lena! What's happened? Is everything alright? The wind suddenly stopped and now monsters have overrun the shrine! What about Father? The king went up to the top floor. He has yet to return. Something must have happened to him. Oh, that music hits you right in the, hits you right in the feels. And the thing is, in the Pixel Remaster, every single bit of this is live instruments. Crystal's up on the top floor, right? Wouldn't hurt to go up and take a look. Ferris, you're right. Come on. The Crystal series is controlled by a machine that amplifies its power. The Crystal amplification machine suddenly stopped responding. Princess, please take these with you. Receive five potions. Drink this water to restore your energy. So we've got an unlimited healing strength. That's good. We can always come back to that. Backstop healing is always a wonderful thing. Tent. Consecrated circle. Okay. This is the... Hey, this is a safe point. You want to use these as often as you can, tutorial. Oh, another thing the minimap has? It gives you a listing of the items that you've looted in the dungeon. So we've gotten two out of four.
I gotta go back and heal. People think I'm playing it overly cautious. That's because I am. I'm absolutely playing it overly cautious. Because I know how bad that griffin can be. So I gotta go over the other way. Well, let's try it. This guy's not playing around. Ate it for lunch, is what we did. Ah, okay. The staff. Crystal. Okay, and now I need to go to the Forge Job Fiesta site and actually unlock my Fiesta job or my wind job. Okay.
Black Mage. No shit. This just suddenly made my day. The crystal. It's shattered. But what the... Courage, the essence of flame. Devotion, the essence of water. Hope, the essence of earth. Passion, the essence of wind. Now do we need to have Captain Planet, the essence of heart? <laughs> what was that? What's happening? Feels warm. Are these the crystal's essences? Lena. Father! Listen, and listen well. You are the chosen four, the warriors of light, bearers of the crystal, four crystal essences. One moment. I also have to update myself on the Four Job Fiesta Discord. It won't let me because I'm in, because I'm actually in OBS and it's streamer mode right now. Okay, listen and listen well. You are the chosen four, the warriors of light, bearers of the four crystal essences. Father, what do you mean? The wind or the wind crystal is already shattered. The other three crystals are in danger as well. You four must protect them. An evil presence is awakening. One that wishes to return everything to the darkness. Father! Go forth, warriors of light, and save the crystals. Wait, no, father! What are these? Guess they're pieces of the crystal. They are crystal fragments and stored within the powers of warriors of legend. Knight, monk, blue mage, thief, black mage, white mage. I know I'm going to have it easy this run. I got black mage. The crystal, it's lending us its power. I think it's time we get out of here. Lena. There should be a war panel behind the altar that will take us outside.
We got an entire group of people saying I put on my robe and wizard hat. Leave? Yes. Now, I already know what they're about to tell me, but I'm going to put it on for you guys. Would you like an explanation about the crystal fragments in the job system? Yes. The fragments of the shattered crystal are imbued with the power of the legendary warriors. The four chosen by the crystals are granted use of those powers in the form of jobs. Are you sure? By assigning jobs, the four characters can gain special abilities that correspond to those jobs. A character's job and abilities determines the type of armor and weapons she can or he or she can equip. Don't worry, characters automatically equip the best available gear whenever you assign a new job. Choose a configuration menu to change gear manually. By mixing and matching different jobs and abilities, you can create warriors with unique skill sets. Such as a black mage that can use the jump ability, or a knight that can use white magic. Let's take the latter as an example of how to use the job system. First, we'll set our job to that of white mage. Much like experience points, as battles are won, you receive ability points. With enough ability points, you can gain the white ability or mage ability, white magic. Now let's switch jobs to that of a knight and choose white magic as the ability. Your equipment will automatically be optimized as the strongest combination. You have now you have successfully created a knight who can perform white magic. Now we need to go to Tool. Grog! Grog! I think I'll stop and have a drink as well. Well, while they're doing that, while they're getting fit chased, Unlike other Final Fantasies where you had to buy magic for each person individually, or Final Fantasy IV where you leveled up everybody's magic, this is a game where you buy the spells for the group or you pick them up. You know, mutually. Now, 
I gotta remember after we finish our doings in the town to equip Ferris. Now these rods, I believe, can be used from the back row. Either way, keeping everybody in the back row as black mages is what we're going to do, because who would be dumb enough to do otherwise? Oh, and it is a magic up. So, yeah, anything that increases their magic, we're going to do. Moons and chests like these have goodies inside. Would you like to try having a look see? So basically, it's like, hey, some chests are ch some chests are trapped. That's what you get for looking. I'm like, you're an asshole. If you look really close, you're a fetching glass, Lena. Take a load off and drink up. Captain's upstairs. There's nothing left. The pirates drank the house dry. Captain's so dreamy. And we're only helping you because the captain orders, so don't be getting the wrong idea. Pirate boss went upstairs. Why don't you have a seat and keep your eyes on me? <laughs> I, I, I'm not looking at anything. You're the perv here, not me. Get your mind out of the gutter. And laugh dance ahoy. Hmm, for you, honey, we've got something special. And Habanera from Carmen. Which they play whenever something sleazy's happening in this game. Ooh. Play the piano. Piano flex! That was bad. <laughs> and the other song they play when something skeevy's going on. 
Oh, I'll, hold on, I'll go check on him. But why you've got that goofy look on your face for? Uh, what do you mean? Must have been a trick of the light or something. Crying out loud, shove over and let me see. Great Caesar's Ghost, just gorgeous, a beauty for the ages. What in the world are you two going on about? Ah, slept like a babe, I did. What are you two gawking at? Get a hold of yourselves. Now shove off. I need some time to myself. Now, if I, okay, now having black mage is going to make a lot of what we need to do in the next couple of dungeons very easy. I'm pretty sure that this is Ox House. Someone you know? Yeah, he built the Torna Canal. Because the next one is a water dungeon. And as we all know with Final Fantasy, water plus thunder equals dead water monsters. Oh, Princess Lena. Socks, good to see you. You too, it's been a long time. Zok, I have a favor to ask. We need to pass through Torna Canal so we can reach walls. I'm afraid it's much too dangerous. Ever since the Wind Crystal was destroyed, a foul beast has made it to the canal its lair. Moreover, I I seem to have lost the key to the canal somewhere. I'm sorry, I can't help you with the key. Still, you've come all this way. Will you at least stay the night? Wonderful, I'll show you to your room. He is a lying stone buck. The crystals. Now that I think of it, they're the reason Dad. The crystals must be protected at any cost. Listen, Stella. If anything should happen to me, never tell Butts about the crystals. They shouldn't be his burden to bear. Oh, darling, please don't say things like that. Father, I protect the crystals, I promise. Snore, snore, and he's like, hmm, hmm. Maybe I fuck maybe I screwed up. What's the matter, Butts? Nothing, I'm just reminded of my folks. They died a while back, though. Here, take it. Huh, take what? The key to the canal. With it, you can open the gate and travel to walls. I was worried for Lena's safety, so I hit the key. Please, take care of her.
Captain, wait up! Sorry, lads, I'm leaving your laggards behind. Captain, but why? You know we'd follow you to the ends of the earth. I know, and I thank you for it, but not this time. Captain! The smells of a long journey. But while I'm gone, I need you louts to guard the hideout. We can't let anyone raid our booty. But Captain, please. Aye, aye, sir. Wind at your back, Captain. Godspeed. And they're all saluting. And because Luna, or sorry, Ferris had to be special, I have to equip them. individually. Lena, what's wrong? The wind crystal is shattered. Right now the wind is only slowed, but soon it will stop blowing completely. In a few years, the air will grow stagnant, and the birds won't have any place to fly. Father said we have to protect the three remaining crystals. Three crystals? Yes, the crystals of fire, water, and earth. But if those were lost too, then what? At first, nothing will happen, but it wouldn't be very long before the earth began to decay, the seas would grow dirty, and rivers would cease to flow. Waters would lose their heat, and the world would turn dark and cold. It really would become an unlivable place. Guys, we've got to protect the crystals. Huh, did something trigger in any of your memories? Nope, doesn't matter. I'm still going to help. Well said, old man. I'm coming to you. Besides, we have to find Lena's father. King Tycoon, but he disappeared in the thin air. He still lives. I feel it in my bones. Never for a moment believe otherwise. But will you come with us? Until now, I was just along for the ride, but things have changed. The crystal shard it. We were given power to protect the world, the power of the wind crystal. That's it, I'm in. We've got some crystals to save. Sure enough, let's be off. Butts, where in Tarnation did you get the key? Does it matter? Let's get going. I'm going to get us to level 7 before we continue to the boss, simply because, well, yeah. Or at least level 6. Octocracker.
Oh, now this is going to be interesting. Might be enough. We're gonna treat it as if it is enough. Go back, restock, reheal, come back in. Level six should be sufficient. Getting tense because I can hear my mother you know, screaming down from heaven, buy some tents, damn it. Because <laughs> that's something she would do. She always liked to make sure when I was playing a game like this that I had enough uh, tents and enough potions and enough antidotes. That is something I don't have, antidotes. What's that? Oh no, the monster of the canal. Thunder or thunder and typhoons, the rudder's not responding. Better figure out something fast, because we're getting sucked in. Like a record baby, right round, round, round. Sildra, what's wrong? Look alive, something's coming! Thunder is enough. Anybody want fried crab? Or would that be boiled crab at this point?
Sildra! I'm sure she's okay. She's a fighter and you know it. Sildra! Let me go. Unhand me, Sildra! Well, that's not good. How's Ferris? As well as can be expected, we should leave him be. The ship is just drifting with the current. Wonder where we'll end up. Ferris, Soldier is surely Soldier's still out there alive somewhere. Where are we? The graveyard of the sea. A gathering place for abandoned and scuttled ships and a nest for the undead. Grr. All the more reason or all the more reason to hot foot it out of here. And the old man gets the bed? That's fair. Oh, I'm in my 40s myself having arthritis out. I get preferential treatment for beds in a camping situation. The power of fire compels you. Try Thunder next time, see how it works. There is a chest that I miss regularly in this area. I need to find out how to unlock.
think I know where I'm going now. We have to go this way. We'll get soaked. What? Are you going to melt or something? Come on. We're making good progress, we're making good XP. Now I'm lost. That's a pain. I have a lot of daggers to sell when I get out of here. I'm soaked. Yeah, there's a fish in my shorts. This room seems safe enough. Let's take a rest. I'm going to change into some dry clothes. No peeking. 
Why do they always say that in these games? Like, it's like... Oh, a decent person wouldn't peek in the first place. Saying that makes you think that you assume that your friends are a-holes. Okay, time to get dry. I'm fine like this. Don't worry about me. Are you crazy, boy? You'll catch pneumonia in those wet things. Hey, what are you doing? Get away. Don't touch me. What's all the commotion? Lena, this... He... Oh, my stars and comets! He's a woman! So if I am, you got a problem with that? Of course not, but why are you trying to hide it? When I was just a lad, or lass, a fighter band took me in. I've been one of them ever since. Yeah, so? Would you want to be the only girl on a ship full of pirates? Hi, I thought from the start you were awfully pretty for a man. Anyhow, make fun of me for being a woman and I'll shiver your timbers for good. Whatever you say. That's right, now I'm turning in and you lots had best do the same. Ah, slept like a log. Raise and shine dollars. Time's a-wasting. Hey, old man. There's enough lollygagging from the likes of you. On your feet. Let's go. Her tone still smacks him a cheese mo to me. No point in trying to change her. Ferris is who she is. That's for certain. Ferris is Ferris. That's cool.
Making our way through slowly. Don't know how much further we'll make it through tonight. Hoping to make it through to the next town. Something special about this place and it ain't the smell of the food. But come closer, Mom. Holding his head and out. Come here, my cherub. Father! Lena? Uh... Grandpa, let's play! Who's that? I just can't remember. Let us eat your soul. Become one of us. Never, demon. Oh, ho I didn't expect any of you to escape the effects of my magic. Greetings. I am Siren. I'm afraid your companion's souls now belong to me. Still, I'm feeling generous. I can be convinced to spare yours if you ran home quietly. You think I would abandon these kids? A fat chance, Missy. Why would you risk your life for these people? Because they're my friends. Don't be fooled by her trickery. Open your eyes. Oh, man. Just... Yeah. Gotta say this about Galuf. His pimp hand is strong. Butt snaps out of it. Lena comes to her senses. Ferris leaves her trance. Galoof! Uh oh, here it comes! We just gotta wait until she turns undead. She turned undead, then we melted her. You know, as the saying goes, kill it with fire. And we did. 
Bronze shield. Ain't gonna be using that. Galoof, you saved us. I you in my life. Eh, don't sweat it. Ah, oh, you're blushing. I'm doing nothing of the sort. Now we're going to Tool. What, you came for the ship rigger? You're not ghosts, are you? Got a little bit of puzzle doing in town to do. And then we'll probably be calling it for the night. Most of the Windrakes were killed in the war 50 years ago. The one in Tycoon is the last of its kind. Purple flowers of blue on the North Mountain are poisonous. Thank you. The dagger might do more damage, the rod does more, you know, makes my magic more effective. So we're gonna use the rods, as much as the game might want us to use the dagger. Knights do it two-handed. Boo. Oh, did you get your hands on a world map? Use it as an item you can see the map in detail. I'll tell you there's dragon grass up on North Mountain, but there's poison grass there too, choking it out. The Windrake and Super Road Dragon Rest, if you get those hands on those, you'd be rolling in gill. Did you hear a meteorite fell near Tycoon? Too bad he didn't land on my mother-in-law. Boo. That ain't funny, man.
Deanna Flex. It wins two weeks, so there ain't no ships sailing. So there aren't any ships, you can't get to Walsh. Not so much with the glorious age of sea travel. Kingdom of Walsh is south of here beyond the sea. They use a machine to amplify the power of the water crystal. We must stop it. How can we get to Walsh? It's a quick trip to sea, but since the winds flow, there aren't any ships sailing. And we haven't got Sildra either. Ferris, I'm sorry. But do you have any ideas? No ships, so we can't go by sea. If we can't go by sea, then lizards and cr or creatures can't hibern or the hibernate can't stand the cold. Frost rod. Starting to ship to Walls, the one's too weak for anything to sail. Is there any ships that can't go all so much of the glorious age of seal? Sail. I really saw it. Up in the north, flying around, a dragon, sure as, it was, sure as I live. What kind of dragon? Was it tamed? What did it look like? Uh, it kind of looked like a dragon. It was wearing some sort of armor, as I recall. Could have been a weird alive Windrake. Here are you. Father's Windrake is on North Mountain. What? Why would it have been there? Well, why would it have been there? On North Mountain grows a plant called Dragongrass. It's the only substance that can heal a Windrake's wounds. That means here you must be hurt. A Windrake, huh? Say, but since land and sea are out, we should take to the air. We can ride to Walsh and hear you. That's a ticket. Now let's get moving to North Mountain. And it is now 148. I don't have time to do North Mountain, so. We are going to save it here after going to rest. Oh, Royal, Royal, yeah, resting. Resting is good. leave the city to do my thingy or to save rather all right thank you all very much for watching this has been harmony muse playing final fantasy 5 we will continue this tomorrow i hope you all enjoyed the show don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons and here's hoping we all enjoy Get make some much better progress tomorrow. <laughs>